Today we're going to make a print of geometric shapes in the form of a robot. So we'll start with our bucket and there's a lot of different shapes here. There's squares, circles, rectangles, there's some more circles and I just have all these different things that will make geometric shapes, either circles, squares, or rectangles. So I'm going to start by figuring out what I want to use for the body. And let's see, I have a long and skinny one. I think if I do two of those, that'll be a perfect size body. Or I could do maybe two of these. Okay. I'm going to go like this, and I'm just going to sort of spread that out. I want a thin layer, and some you can kind of move that around just like that. And getting that paint on the bottom edge. And then I'm just going to make the body. I'm going to center it so I have enough room for the head and the legs. And I print, and then I pull it up, and I'm going to re-dip it. Every time that you want to repeat something, you have to dip it again into the paint. And there's the body of my robot. Now I'm not going to leave it in the paint. You can go ahead and just put it to the side and then someone else can use that because there'll be a, a cardboard in the center of your table. Leave them so that they can be picked up. Don't leave them in the paint because they'll be in the way. And I think I'm going to make a, well, I think I'm going to do a circular head. Yours can be different. There we go. There's a circle for the head. And then I'm going to make some joints. So I'm going to take this cork. Oops, I left it in the, I want to put that over here for someone else to use. And then I'm going to, there's the neck. Maybe I'll make a shoulder joint there and there. And then I got to find something for the arms. I think that'll make a good arm. Oh, let's see. I think I'm going to make some circles. Let's see, I've got this marker cap. Maybe I'll make some circles. And I'm going to use some cardboard for the mouth. Another thing that you can do, if you want just little lines, is you can take the end of a piece of cardboard and you could make hair. Mm -hmm. Looks like an eye. You yeah. could make a mouth. Uh, <laughs> okay. Maybe a nose. Eyebrows. And say that this was the hand, you could also make fingers. So you can do some things with just the edge of the cardboard dipped into the paint if you want to make some lines. Maybe you want to put some circles on the end of that. Make it look like electrodes or something. I don't know. But there's a lot of different things that you can do. I want all of yours to be very creative and there's no right or wrong way to do this. Um, just make it into a robot. That's your assignment. Do your best work.